I saw the signs that said white waiting, colored waiting. We were beaten. Some of us almost died. We made progress, but we're not there yet. While John Lewis is known as a heroic face of the civil rights movement, many forget the incredible danger he faced to change the country. The civil rights icon passed away at 80 years old, an age many of his peers in the movement never reached. Lewis's full life isn't exactly the norm for civil rights activists. Malcolm X, Martin Luther King Jr., and Medgar Evers were all assassinated before the age of 40. Where do we go from here? But even as Lewis transitioned from an activist to a lawmaker, he remained a vocal advocate for questioning the system, rattling the cage of what's acceptable in the interest of equality. Get in and stay in the streets of every city, every village and hamlet of this nation until true freedom come, until the revolution of 1776 is complete. Where is the compassion? Where is the sense of decency? Where is the heart of this Congress? History reminds us that on March 7, 1965, we loved America so dearly, we were ready to die for her. Lewis came close to death several times before the age of 30. His role in the Freedom Rides, the March on Washington, and Selma voting rights campaign made him a target for law enforcement, public officials, and angry white mobs. Lewis was arrested 45 times, faced beatings, escaped buses that were set on fire, and dealt with constant death threats before and after the March on Washington. Those who have said be patient and wait, we must say that we cannot be patient. We do not want our freedom gradually, but we want to be free now. We are tired of being beaten by policemen. We're tired of seeing our people locked up in jail over and over again. And then you holler, be patient. How long can we be patient? At the time, those who fought for equality weren't known as patriotic and heroic Americans, but viewed by many private citizens and government as threats. Lewis stood side by side many of those who were killed for their ideas and activism while still young men. Lewis went on to serve nearly 34 years in Congress, pushing for equality until the very end. Some people gave more than a little blood. Some gave their very lives. Go out there. Speak up. Speak out. Get in the way. Get in good trouble. Necessary trouble. And help redeem the soul of America. Hey, NBC News viewers, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.